tonight I've got a great book for us and it's called The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carl. And it's done by Puffin Books. At the start, for my sister Krista. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. There it is. There's the moon. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop! Out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. There he is. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. There he is. Yum, 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 yum. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. Look, you can see he's eating some holes. Yum, 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 yum. There he is again. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums. But he was still hungry. One, two, three. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries. But he was still hungry. One, two, three, four. Let's have a look. There he is. Yum, 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 yum. On Friday, he ate through five oranges. But he was still hungry. One, two, three, four, five. Oh my goodness, look at this. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake, one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami, one lollipop, and one piece of cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake, and one slice of of watermelon. That night, he had a stomach ache. I bet you would have after eating all of that. Look, oh my goodness. Look at all that food. <gasps> at least the watermelon's healthy. I don't think the rest is healthy. It's not good food, but yum. That night, he had a stomach ache. Oh, I bet you would too. Yum, 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 yum. He's eating through a leaf. The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf. And after that, he felt much better. He would. He's eating some good food now. Let's have a look what happens next. Now he wasn't hungry anymore. And he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big, fat caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out and what's happened next? Let's have a look. <gasps> he was a beautiful butterfly. Look at him. He's turned from a caterpillar into a butterfly. Look at those wings, huh? those wings. Wow, he's beautiful. And that is the end. After all of that food and all of that time, he turned into a beautiful caterpillar. And that's the story of the very hungry caterpillar. I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time.